Okay, great. So this next demo we're showing here is our multi-link demo. And the point of this demo is to show the capabilities of our soft device, so our Bluetooth uh, protocol stack. So if we go down and look a bit at the demo, we can see we have uh, 10 Thingy52 devices running on just regular 1 Mbps uh, Bluetooth low energy. And we also have two long range links here. So this is a long range link, which I'll explain a bit later. So this is using Bluetooth long range 125 kilobit per second uh, coded phi. And this one here is actually running three phi's at the same time. So we're running two Mbps high throughput mode. We're running standard one Mbps mode and also coded phi 125 kilobit per second. But I'll explain these two a bit later. Uh, for now, we can see if I press uh, this button here, we can actually see that all of the lights turn on and off, including this little LED down here it also turns on and off. Um, we can actually, I can press, uh, I think it's this button here, which actually turns uh, this LED on and off. Uh, one thing I forgot to mention is that this is essentially an aggregator, so this is the central node for all of these uh, peripheral nodes. And, but it is also a peripheral to this uh, phone app. So we do also have a phone app here, which you can see. And here we can actually see all of the different devices that are connected to this uh, 52840 DK aggregator device. So here if I basically, I can click these two, for example, turn on and off the light, and you can actually see which of the lights turn on and off. I can also just, we can also see which Phi it's using. So there's a lot of good information you can see here. Uh, if, if it's a thingy device, we can actually also change the color. So I can turn it on. We can actually see that the color is actually changing. So the color of that device is changing. So yeah, again, just to recap quickly, the, the whole point of this is to showcase the capabilities of our soft device so that we can run up to 20 links and you can run different phi's too. So you have multi-phi, you can run uh, coded phi, 125 kilobit per second, you can run standard one Mbps, and you can also run two Mbps uh, high throughput mode. Okay. I think we can stop here. So as we can see, this is still part of the multi-link demo. So seeing that this, uh, this LED is green, which basically means we are still connected over Bluetooth long range to the 52840 uh, aggregator that is located at our booth uh, over there. And if we zoom in uh, to this display over here, this is the 52840 uh, DK, which is connected on uh, three different FIs. So we can actually see the top two, so the 1 Mbps and the 2 Mbps are disconnected now, but the long range is still connected with uh, 21 dB. So that's to showcase that on long range, due to the forward error encoding, you are able to get, um, you are able to get a better RX sensitivity and also a better link budget.